Anxiety in the sky as a relatively small number of Americans are still traveling by air during the pandemic. Some passengers, however, complain that both airlines and airports aren't doing enough to protect their health. We have pictures from a St. John's County man who recently flew home from Boston through Chicago. He says his flight was crowded and fellow travelers at the airport were not practicing social distancing. He shared his story with News 4 Jacks reporter Vic Michelucci. Jimmy Solari says he was essentially forced to fly. Some of the passengers were wearing masks, some weren't. He flew American Airlines to Massachusetts to see his father on his deathbed. He made it just in time to say goodbye. But on his way back to Jacksonville Sunday, his stopover at Chicago O'Hare was concerning. The bartender was leaning on the bar with no mask on. There were people standing arm in arm without masks on. Solari sharing these photos from the airport. He says they show lack of concern during the coronavirus outbreak. Uh, probably about half the people in the airport were wearing masks and appeared to have been taking this thing seriously. His flight was worse. How full was your flight? Uh, it was the seats were two by two and it appeared that front to back it was a full flight. He says he was appalled and anxious. And they were even claiming to be practicing social distancing stuff, which essentially was don't sit next to our jump seat so you don't get us sick and we're not going to be bringing you in-flight refreshments, so no peanuts and no water, but you're gonna sit next to each other and there's nothing you can do about it. Because of that not so pleasant experience and since he works at local hospitals, he decided to go and get tested for the coronavirus. So today he went to the Lot J testing site in downtown Jacksonville, got an antibody and a traditional test. The antibody test has already come back negative, thankfully. American Airlines started requiring all passengers to wear masks yesterday. They can only take them off to eat or drink. The airline's also saying it's restricting access to some seats when possible to give you more space. And when time and flight loads permit, gate agents may move your seat as needed to help create a more comfortable environment. This is not about individuals. This is about the community. Downtown, I'm Vic Michelucci, Channel 4 the local station. American Airlines sent us a statement saying, quote, American will not assign 50% of main cabin middle seats or seats near flight attendant jump seats every flight and will only use those middle seats when necessary. On flights that don't have middle seats, we're blocking seats strategically throughout the cabin. If a customer is booked and to fly, American Airlines says it is waiving change fees for all customers who have travel booked through September 30th.